Hey gangs, John here, and welcome back at long last to Minecraft Hardcore. Um, if you're wondering whatever happened to Season 1, uh, I talked about this in a video or two, but if you missed that, um, basically, uh, my world got corrupted because I was bouncing between versions, and yeah, I ended up uh, losing out. And that was too bad, you know, because we had made a good start, but, eh whatever anyway the point is we're doing it again and this time we're doing it in uh, the newest snapshot which of course means horses so yeah it's gonna be interesting to see but I'm still sticking to my plan to be a nomad uh, I'm not gonna build I'm not gonna stay in one area uh, at least for a little while um, my end goal I think is probably going to be to fight the Ender Dragon if possible. Um, in which case, I will have to stop and get the necessary things and then hunt for a stronghold. But um, until until that time comes, until we're kitted out and all that, I kind of want to wander, you know, see what the world has to offer. So, yeah. Let's create a new world here. Hardcore S2 World Options. Let's um let's see. What are we gonna use for a seed? Um <laughs> should I? Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> it had to be done. Alright, let's create in, create the world. And we're in a jungle. Okay. Oh, I'm seeing through the world. Dang it. Stop doing that. Alright. Hmm. We have ocean over here. We have ocean here. That's no. Here. Yes. Okay, that's interesting. A little patch of snow on the edge of the jungle. And yet more jungle. But that's See, that's pretty cool. That little island. Now, like, if that was a survival island thing, just that out in the ocean, that would be pretty cool. Alright. Um, you know, we might find a temple right off. That would be awesome. That would be a great way to start. Uh, I should be getting logs here. A little cave. Maybe get some early iron and coal from this. Ooh. Lots of broken terrain here. Um. Hmm. I just thought maybe I might see a temple. Like, easily spotted, but guess not. Guess we're not going to be that lucky. <laughs> Unlike Justin in his LPs, what was it, episode 2, he finds a temple. <laughs> I should make a sword. This is, wow, dark here. Oh my gosh. You guys, just stay where you are, trapped in the tree. Until <laughs> I get to get some startup tools here. So yeah, as soon as I get stuff that I need. Um, we will head out. Alright. Whoops. The workbench plot down. Get you going. I wish it wouldn't split that stuff apart. That's it's kind of annoying <laughs> in a way. Oh that's right, this snapshot adds uh, attributes, kind of like terraria, it's like random stuff added to the stuff you make. This wooden pickaxe has plus two attack damage. Two shots on a chicken. Well, I guess that just means it never was that strong to begin with, but it's pretty neat that you can get random, um, I mean, they're practically like enchantments for free. 
Also, you can get negative ones. Just keep that in mind as well. Alright. Let's get some cable. So that we can make the appropriate tools and start exploring. But yeah, um, I don't plan on doing too much editing or anything with this. Uh, last time I said I was just not going to edit at all, you know, just show every step of the way. Uh, we'll probably stick to that until maybe we get to the point where we're trying to find a stronghold or whatever, because the, you know, the time you have to spend leading up to that would probably take a while. Um... So, yeah. Hmm. Oh my gosh, stop doing that, really. Let's do that first. Um. What are you doing in there? There's a. Where'd that other one go? Oh, he's out here. Ooh, desert. I do like wandering around in deserts. It's a good place to be nomad nah, blah, 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 nomadic. Alright. Um yeah, no, I'm gonna need a lot more logs here. Actually, let's just make an axe right off here just to make this simpler. Oh I could have done that anyway. Alright, well whatever. Um, make things a bit simpler. Plus four attack damage, nice. And this, and that's got a plus three. All right, that's very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Maybe it's not random so much as trying to inform you that it doesn't make a very good weapon. Yeah, because this is five. So it's like plus five over punching something. This is plus three over punching something. This is plus four over punching. Alright. Wait, so this has no, so this is the same as punching. Got it. Well, that makes sense, actually. So it's not really an enchantment, but I do know that there are some things that can change how you use them. I don't know if that's in this version yet or not, but like a sword that might swing slower or faster, or maybe a helmet that will boost your uh, strength while wearing it. I don't know, something like that. So that's interesting. Um, yeah, must have a shovel. Uh -huh. Let's get this kind of organized the way I like it. Right. We need a furnace. We are getting hungry already. Alright, you cook. I will probably gather some more logs. But yeah, I um I was just kind of in the mood for some hardcore because the threat of death has gotten to the point in Minecraft, at least for me, where there's not really a threat. Because <laughs> um, even if I die, I'm, I'm fairly certain that I can recover my stuff or whatever. But hardcore, you cannot die at all. And uh, that's kind of it's kind of a good thing because. Um, Um, it's kind of a good thing because it puts puts that nervousness back in you that okay I don't I don't want to mess this up. Um, speaking of which, <laughs> where's the sun? All right, it's already starting its downward path. If I could find some sheep, that would be great. And what's over here actually? Aside from the dead owl desert. 
I might end up spending the night in the desert if I can't find a sheep because um, it's a good place to be able to see everything that's around you and such. Will you just die? Alright. But yeah, I've got goals, you know. I want uh, diamond tools, I want an enchanting table, I want enchanted armor. Um. Where? Where are you, chicken? Like it's down here, but I don't see it. Oh well, whatever. Let's go up over here to the plains. There might be horses. That would be cool. Not that we have a saddle, but. <laughs> oh, you were. Update your territory. Alright. Um, horses. Do you see any horses? I don't. This might be a better place to be than the uh, jungle, anyway. Yeah, I don't really see any horses. It's too bad. Um, I need to go back to get that coal, but... I think I might head over there to the desert for the night since I don't seem to be seeing any sheep or any animals other than those chickens, actually. Speaking of which... Oh, well, take that back. There's a cat. <laughs> Almost wouldn't be a bad idea to have one of those because uh, they keep the creepers away. <laughs> but, eh. They're also rather annoying. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Just get over there. I get my coal. Ow. Come on. There it is. Alright. Um, actually, I have another idea. Stop splitting apart. Seriously. So we'll grab this. This. Eat. And let's go. Let's go out here, see what's going on. Hmm. No, turn. Thank you. Uh, hmm. I mean, it's not, like, super dangerous. As long as I avoid the skellies, it should be alright. Speaking of which... <laughs> so the boats don't turn anymore unless you're pushing the forward button as well. That's kind of annoying. Alright. Actually, I'm going to want that back, so... Um, let's grab some of these, why not? Even some of this, you never know. Might need to lay it behind me as a defense or something. <laughs> oh, hello. I don't think I'm prepared to face you. Unless you want to walk into a cactus. Loosen yourself up a little bit. Oh, wow. Wow. Luck is with me, as usual. I already got a bow. Alright, I'm going to loosen him up, though, with the two arrows, because... There he is. And I missed, of course. Okay. Back to two arrows again. Wow, look how many of them just spawned. Oh my gosh. Seriously? Wow. Alright. Small desert. Hello. Junk air over there. Hmm. 
I mean, I'm technically safe. Oh, look at the charcoal looks different now. That's cool. Huh. Wait. Yeah, that's neat. Charcoal. Huh. I was not aware of that. There's probably other things that I'm not aware of in this snapshot. Hmm. Well, I don't just want to stand around. I mean, seriously. Um, I guess let's explore. What the heck? Probably try to avoid sprinting though, since I don't have a lot of food. Avoid him. Hmm. Kind of hoping to see a village or a temple. Look at that spider, how stupid it is. It's dead. <laughs> nope. Ooh. Load up for your world. Uh, let's see. Anything out this way? Forbid. Nope. Not yet. Swamp. Might be a witch. <laughs> Actually, it's funny. I found a couple of those randomly before, and they never have witches in the huts. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Oh, wait. Sheep. Okay. And some cows. Okay, so this is looking up. It's funny though, I uh, I was watching David R sixty four YT's most recent Minecraft video. You might know him better as X as in X's Adventures in Minecraft. <laughs> um He was talking about oh, 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 you thought you were gonna do it, but I'm I'm a pro. Um, anyway, he was talking about how that first time you play Minecraft is, it can't be, uh, it can't be recreated. That first time you're in the game and the sun starts to set and you're like, oh, now it's dark. Oh, there are things going to kill me. And, and just that feeling. And it's true. You never quite get that back. But what I like about hardcore is that I know if if I'm not careful that it's all over I gotta start over um, but I have to admit even even in hardcore daytime is unless you're caving <laughs> why didn't that go, Eat. There we go. Uh, unless you're caving or something daytime is obviously fairly safe and it takes whoa are you kidding me a spider jockey in full gold armor? I have never seen anything like that. Wow. Look at that guy. Oh, he's going to wreck my day. Is he coming for me? Oh, he is. Tell you what. Let's not get too overconfident here. Um, but, what I was going to say is, maybe, maybe I won't use the bed right away, like only in specific situations where I'm in need of it being day or whatever, because it does, it does take some of that anxiety away. <laughs> it's got to be admitted. Go over here. Maybe we'll see a temple or a village. Village would be really nice. Give me a safe place to stay and maybe some cool supplies too. Like in season one, that village I found that was 
For crying out loud, Lily Pen. Sometimes they they don't break the boat and sometimes they do. Did it break entirely? Or did it just pop off? You know like it does. I don't see it. Dang. Well, that's annoying. Oh, sun's coming up. The sun will come out tomorrow. Yeah, um anyway. <laughs> Oh, creeper. But yeah, um... It's... It's, um... It's something I'm thinking about. Just maybe trying to survive for real, you know? Kind of get back some of that... Excitement, some of that fear from the first time, you know, I played the game.